everyone, my name is Angela and welcome to Angela's Fashion Mix, where I share how I get dressed day to day, right from my closet, by mixing and matching things I already have. And when I do shop, I try to find something that is versatile enough to feed into what I have to create new looks. And today I am sharing one of my favorite prints, and that's the animal print. And I am most fond of the leopard print. So I am starting with these two basic pieces in the cream and white today. Of course, it could be black and white. I've got a gold earring on, and I have on a camel shoe as my base. Camel color in my pump, my favorite. And I'm going to start off by adding a scarf. Easiest thing to do is to add a scarf. My favorite print here. And there's a few ways we can do this. I could just drop it here. That's totally fine. That looks totally fine. That's one way. Or I could just tie it here at the neck and let it fall. That kind of defines it more and creates a little more of a focal point right down the center. But my favorite, my absolute favorite style with regard to a scarf is to do this. And I do like this particular silky kind of fabric here because it gives me an opportunity to spread it out here more and create a real powerful focal point right here at the neckline. So that's an option there. Or I can just simply twist it to the side and that creates a little bit of more sassy look there. How about that? So I really like that. Just doing something simple with the scarf to take that look to another direction. So that's one way. I also could keep the same two pieces and just add a handbag in the animal print. This bag is pretty old. This is Beyonce's design with her mom from the house of Darion. So I've had this for several years, but I still actually love the shape of it and it works well with the black and white combination. So that's another way. Just add a handbag in the favorite print. From there, I'm going to add a belt in black. I'll tell you why it's black in a minute. So we are adding the black belt, and I am adding one of my favorite jacket styles in a three-quarter length. My favorite is the three-quarter length in the animal print. So we're just keeping it pretty simple on the base. And the reason I added this, the black belt, is to just kind of break up the two pieces there in the middle. I still have on the same shoe, but you could, of course, wear black with it. Totally fine there. Another way to incorporate the animal print into your wardrobe. Okay, so I don't want to do that. I can simply add, of course, an animal print belt. As you can see, I have the print in a lot of different items. Just give it some variation. You're going to wear it. You're going to wear a belt. Why not make it an animal print belt? And this one has a gold buckle. And again, just breaks up two pieces. It coordinates well with the camel color on the shoe. There we have that. And for my final, when it's time to go outside, I am putting on this particular jacket. And guess what with? I also have gloves in this print. Now the thing about the animal print for me, it is so versatile and it doesn't take a lot to just add a little punch somewhere. I'm pulling out my sleeve here to just kind of add a little bit of extra interest there. But for the gloves, that is a great way to just add a little bit of the print. Now here is where I will change my shoe because of course you know I have it in an animal print. My favorite style is the pump. I also have that 
to coordinate with this. Now the reason I changed the shoe is to show you that with your shoe and with the glove, these two areas broken up still gives you the opportunity to have both prints have the same print in two different places. So very simply adding the gloves and the one final touch to just kind of complete my look. For me, it's not an animal print, but I think with this particular jacket and all of this together, I think that works really well. So this is how I wear animal prints in a variety of ways. Of course, not all together, just kind of thinking about where I want the focal point to be. Just keeping it really simple, mixing and matching day to day. Everyone, I thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you very soon.